I am Vasil Lamachenka, you are watching Dante's Boxing Nation. Really know a lot of Chocolatito's opponents, you know what I mean? And when Chocolatito's finishing fight, and he's fun to watch, don't get me wrong, he's great to watch, he's exciting, he's got a lot of offensive prowess. But when you're finishing fights with your eyes closed, homie, you're not pound for pound, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you can't be getting hit like that, you know? Pound for pound means offense and defense. And he's a fun fighter to watch. He's, he's, you know, excitement value. I think that's the problem with the, mo the media here. The media in this country, especially, they forget. They, they don't understand that excitement value and, 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 and ability to, and, and effectiveness. Excitement value and effectiveness are two different things. And sometimes they don't go in the same room at all. Sometimes you put, they're actually in two different rooms. Sometimes they can be mixed together, but a lot of the times effectiveness and, and excitement value are in totally different rooms. Arturo Gatti was exciting as hell. He was never going to be the one more pound for pound guy. You know what I'm saying? So Chocolatito is exciting as hell. He's effective to a degree. I don't know how effective he is getting finishing fights with his eyes closed, though. You know what I mean? You're getting touched a little too much. The defense is part of the effective part of fighting. You know, it's effectiveness is defense. It's defense, too. So, you know, that's why Vladimir Klitschko never got any credit. That's why guys like Pernod Whitaker a lot of times never got any credit. You know, effectiveness is, is effectiveness. It's not there to twist it with excitement value. Let's, let's not be like these people, all that, that just become fans. If you're going to criticize, you got to criticize the whole spectrum of things. Do you believe the reason why some fans or even media members do that because they can't separate their personal emotions absolutely. from talking because about it's, the fact? Yeah, absolutely, because you know, it's natural to want to root for the guy who gets your, your adrenaline pump and gets your blood flow. Oh man, this guy is something. Oh man, you want to root for him. Now you, all of a sudden you start creating scenarios in your mind. Like, oh, he's the best. What is he the best at? Getting hit? You know what I'm saying? Like, what is he the best at? You know, the, some of these guys are effective offensive fighters, but for me, a pound for pound great, top pound for pound guy has to have the effectiveness offensively and defensively. You gotta show me something complete so that you, I can put you in with any style and you can be effective and you can beat him, you can effectively beat that style. 